What's up everyone, this is Todd Hazelton with Techno Buffalo. Today we're checking out the LG Optimus L9. It's a new $79.99 handset that's after a $50 mail-in rebate. We'll get a quick look at it. T-Mobile's not offering the higher-end Optimus G, so this is the option uh, that it has apparently right now. So October 31st it will be available. We'll go through it real quick. Volume buttons on the left-hand side right there. Micro USB charging on the bottom. Power button on the right. Oh battery covers coming off a little bit 3.5 millimeter headphone jack up top let's quickly open it I'll show you the insides here you've got expandable storage uh, up to 32 gigabytes I believe you've got the sim card and then the battery uh, right there let's get it booted up Oop, I'm putting it on upside down oh I'm sorry before we get it booted up let's go through the box real quick you guys know what to expect here you've got the charger wall mount and then in here is the uh, paperwork Welcome, how to use the device, safety information. You know the ritual. All right, let's, uh, here, it's already powered on. Let's just get going. Look at that. Okay, so front-facing camera here. You've got a five megapixel camera with a single LED flash on the back. We'll go through it real quick. So like the Optimus G on Sprint and AT&T, it has some neat features such as quick memo right here. So you can activate that. It's already active. And say you want to say like, hey man, you got to download, you got to download that app. Don't do it though, because Google Navigation's free and it's, it's awesome. And then, so then you just quickly, uh, you're like, all right, that's great, save it. Whoop, I hit the share button. Save it, and you're good to go. You can just send it to a friend and say, hey, download that app. Real quick for comparison, this is next to the uh, Optimus G on Sprint. You've got the 13 megapixel camera on the back of that one, a nicer, glassier finish, although it attracts fingerprints as you can see, a nicer, larger, and higher resolution display, uh, true IPS. We'll go through real quick, you can see there's some bloatware uh, on, blah, blah, blah. Installed already, HD camcorder, it shoots 1080p video. Lots of T-Mobile things, mobile hotspot, it's always great. Visual voicemail, not bad, T-Mobile TV, don't use it. Settings, about the phone, software, it's running Android 4.0.4 .4, and I don't believe it's on the list to receive Jelly Bean. It always could, we don't know that, um, but that would be down the line. Everything else pretty standard here, you've got LG's sort of tweaked user interface. It has a 1 gigahertz processor dual core, as opposed to the uh, Optimus G which has quad. But here you can just change some uh, different settings so that you're not running out of battery all the time. Uh, Bluetooth doesn't consume that much, but you know you want to keep some things off or make sure your brightness goes down or whatever. So anyway guys, that's a quick look here at the T-Mobile LG Optimus L9. It launches, like I said, October 31st at $79.99 after a $50 mail-in rebate. This is Todd Hazelton with Techno Buffalo.